Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. Well, things don't look too bad out there right now. You know, we've got a mix of sudden clouds, but clouds are increasing. And enjoy some sunshine this morning because this afternoon there's going to be a lot more clouds building in from the west. And here's, uh, we're also going to see some scattered showers moving in too. Here's why. High pressure is moving away from us. We've got a stationary front that's sitting here over North Carolina and some moisture coming up from the south that's riding over that. It's going to give us some scattered showers later today. So between that and weak area low pressure moving a little closer from the west, yeah, we'll see some scattered showers. At the moment, they're over towards Rocky Mount. We've got some in here around Bertie County, uh, more around mainland Dare County, Manio, Wanchies, down to Rodanthe. So a few showers in this direction, but nothing in Hampton Roads right now. They're still to our south and off to our west. Now, we go through the morning, we're going to increase the clouds, and there's already going to be some isolated showers at least through that time. We've seen them on radar already in North Carolina, so expect that at least, and probably some into Hampton Roads. Now, our model just updated. It backed off the rain. We're going to see some very light scattered showers, and sometimes the model just kind of uh, goes back and forth on whether or not it's thick clouds or showers. We are going to see some scattered showers out there, and you can see hints of it, but it's going to be sprinkles and light showers through 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Now, we go into 6 o'clock. There'll still be a few along the coast, but then they're going to move out, and we'll be dry overnight. Now we're dry for tomorrow for sure. We got uh, partly cloudy skies looking good through the day on Thursday. Temperatures a little cool, but not bad. Low 50s and uh, we'll see maybe a little more clouds towards the end of the day, but no rain up through 8 p.m. According to future track. Now let's take a look at the long term here. I'm going to use the European model for that. We've got maybe a few showers at that time, the same time, Thursday 8 p.m. Uh, we'll see. We'll see if they make it in here by that. Time. Now here's Friday. We get some scattered showers. Some of the other models are starting to back off on the rain for Friday, by the way. And then this model has some rain Saturday morning early, but then it kicks it out, and the rest of Saturday's looking okay. Saturday afternoon might be pretty nice out. If the rain is, truly does move away, we might see some sunshine there for a while. And then quiet up through Sunday morning, but then it brings some rain in late in the day on Sunday, uh, close to us at 3 o'clock, but it really brings it in the evening. Now, if it speeds up a little bit, we could see a wetter Sunday during the day. Rain for Sunday night and then rain for Monday morning on this model. Let's take a look at one more, though. This is the GFS model. It has a wintry mix in here for Monday morning. So the models are split on the timing for some of this rain moving in and out, and it's uh, split on how fast the cold air gets in here Monday morning. Stay tuned for updates. No matter what, we're going to have some colder air moving in Monday into Tuesday. But uh, will we see that wintry mix? It's possible. Uh, we'll have updates as the models get, cl we get closer in time. Hopefully the models will come together in agreement on that. So right now, temps there in the low to mid-40s. We've got a mix of sun and clouds. Clouds will increase today, and we'll get those scattered showers. Temperatures, upper 40s to low 50s. It's not too different from north to south. Uh, 48 Melfa, 50 in Norfolk, 52 Currituck, 49 Virginia Beach, 49 in Hampton. Tomorrow, highs in the low 50s, partly cloudy skies. Some scattered showers on Friday, 49. Warmer on Saturday, 60. And for now, it just looks like a few showers in the morning. Stay tuned for updates of that weekend forecast. It'll likely change a little bit.